So I'm a clinical pharmacist in the oncology area here at Duke. Uh, my daily activities usually uh, consist of rounding on multidisciplinary team, seeing patients, uh, verifying medication orders, as well as educating patients, other healthcare professionals, and uh, pharmacy students. My first interest in the pharmacy profession came from my aunt as a pharmacist. She was a great role model for me. Uh, in order to become pharmacist, it takes about six to eight years of education. So the minimum requirements to get into pharmacy school takes about two years of pre-pharmacy work. Uh, majority of schools nowadays do require you to have a bachelor's degree before coming into the professional school, which is four years as well. I went to uh, pharmacy school at Campbell University here in North Carolina and it took me total with pre-pharmacy school eight years to finish. My first job out of school was uh, as a resident uh, in specialty oncology uh, here at Duke and after that I stayed on as a clinical pharmacist in oncology here at Duke. Some of the biggest stressors that we encounter in working with oncology patients is just the emotional stress of uh, patients who are very sick. Um, also, especially if they are younger patients, uh, kind of hits close to home. Other than that, uh, there are days when it's very busy at work, so that can be stressful as well. But I would say just the emotional part of it. The most positive experience about my job is having a um, interaction with patients and ability to take care of them on a daily basis. I also enjoy a great deal working with other um, professionals and just teaching other professionals as well as learning every day from them. I would definitely suggest this uh, career. Um, it's very rewarding. It can be very challenging as well, but it is very rewarding. And there's such a wide variety of things that you can do with pharmacy, from being a clinical pharmacist to working at uh, IV room or compounding pharmacy or outpatient in the community pharmacy. So there's a lot of different things that can be done. My role at Duke is important because I participate in a multidisciplinary team and make sure that patients get medications they need and they are getting the correct medications. I also make sure that they uh, are aware what these medications are used for and what are some of the potential side effects, as well as some of the interactions um, that they may encounter while taking those medications. I also make sure that once we send them home, we send them home on appropriate medications. Um, some other roles that we take is teaching students and residents as well as uh, nursing and uh, physicians.